Alrighty. A little intermittent vi video here. I painted the uh, door with satin. I think it's called semi. Or stolen. And so here's this material. Now, this is actually the back side. The front side is real glossy. The diamond pattern. But the back side actually has a leather green and you can just barely see the diamond pattern I mean I'm happy with it for 15 bucks you get what is this stuff yeah all kinds of metric stuff so you get 68.5 centimeters told you there you go 12 feet so, it's supposed to be for, I guess, making little traction pads. It's pretty thick. You can still cut it with scissors. And when I'm done, I'll just I'd lay the factory edge down in that groove. That's a straight line. And I put a bead of silicone. It's just some clear seven, eight dollar silicone at Home Depot. And that held it in place enough. I can fold it up. Cut these two holes, that helps hold, hang on to it. That piece of tape doing wonders. I just started cutting around the corner there. I don't know if it shows up, but you know, this metal dips in, so it gives you a good spot. It's a little high here to lay a razor blade down in there. It's all, I'd rather cut a little big first. Yeah, keep trimming down into it. If I was smart, after I get this one right, I'd use it as a pattern, but I'm gluing it in because it's it's glued in here and also a couple dabs up in here. And the diamond pattern keeps it from really laying flat, flat. So anyway, all right. So this is the intermittent. Hopefully, I'll figure out how to splice all these. All right, more later.